we always thought that Roots was a very special record, so that would be really cool uh, to translate live because you got you have a lot to play with, you know. Uh, and there's a challenge, like Igor said, there's a big challenge involved in, in recreating Roots 20 years later on trying to play the stuff as close to the original as possible. That was that was a big challenge. So in, in our life right now, in our career, to take on a challenge like that, it's really cool. You know, we, we were up for it, you know, we say, let's do it. So it started kind of kind of crazy. The beginning was, was, we couldn't, we were trying to figure out how to play those songs and it was kind of a little bit of a mind fuck, you know, it was like, damn it, man, this is hard, you know, like, but little by little we got, we got going and now it's rolling like a machine. We got, we're playing the whole full record, every song, exactly like the album, which is really, really killer, I think, for the fans and for us. What's, what's really cool about this tour is for the fans, you know, because we are fans of music yeah. ourselves. So we, we like to, to show them as much as, as if we were in the crowd watching um, we, we, this is what we would like to see, is how we are representing Roots right now, as a fan, you know, in a fan mind. I think that we carry that with this, which I think is really cool to do it. We have a really great band, you know, Rizzo is a great guitar player, uh, Chow is a killer bass player. Uh, so it's, it sounds really good. And I think what is cool is a lot of, um, like you say, a lot of people that weren't around at that time, they get to come to the show now, they get to see it, how it was. There's the people that only saw on YouTube. Um, but this is actually even different from that. You know, this is a whole new thing. It's a whole new monster that, that we created for only for this tour, you know. And that involves everything from the imagery, which is really cool. I think the merchandise is also really killer. There's a company that Igor got hooked up in Spain. They do some stuff for Converge, you know. So they did the whole line, man, you know, yeah. which is... Like, like the visual straight. identity we try to, to keep as... As, as cool as we want it, you know, and, and that's something that me and Max, we always, again, we look at things as a fan, you know, like yeah. I wouldn't put it out unless it's something that I would wear. And, you know, the same thing with the with the whole Roots concept of going back to Roots. When we talk a bit, I, I was still kind of like not 100%. And I was in London and I went to see a Flag, which with the guys from Black Flag perform and they kicked my ass and i was like yes you know this this for me it proves the guys are like super old and they're like insane good maybe better than a lot of the videos that i saw on youtube so that inspired me a lot to to do this as a fan because i was like in the crowd watching this band and i was like okay they're kicking my ass so we can do this also so it's really cool <laughs> I think it's, it's uh, for me, it's, it's, it's really cool to see people doing that stuff now that's like pushing the envelope, carrying the fire, you know, that uh, that the metal has. Uh, when you look at a band like Full of Hell, you know, um, they're insane, you know, they're totally pushing the boundaries, you know, uh, especially when they went on tour with, with the body, you know, it was like fucking ridiculous. Was a, was a sonic assault on on all terms, you know. That's so good, man, to see people doing that, you know. So yeah. I, I love that about these kids, man. And they're young too, which is really killer, you know. So it's very, uh, uh, for me, very inspiring. Yeah, yeah. inspiring. Yeah, yeah, you know. And because uh, I also can see ourselves in that a lot, you know. Like when we start up, we we had that attitude that a lot of these bands that we're seeing now, and it's cool that we we somehow we still can we can have a relationship with it connect with connect yeah. somehow so it's really cool because we we do see ourselves in like when we're 14 15 just going completely crazy with sepultura at the time and breaking a lot of barriers and uh, to see all these young bands doing that for us it's it's refreshing but also it kicked our ass you know to to do more you know as, as musicians it's cool <laughs> Of back in the day when we were involved a lot with the underground tape, tape trading, you know, we were tape trading with the guys from Mayhem and, and Def and Morbid Angel and uh, Creator. And uh, so I think it's the same uh, spirit is alive with that. Like when you search for bands, I, I'm a big searcher. 
I'm always searching for new stuff. And when I found something that I like, I, I love to get in touch with them and get the shirts. I want to represent them. I want to wear their shirts, you know, which I like the home record uh, example, you know, it's like yeah. perfect. And so I think uh, that's kind of like the underground spirit that, you, you know, it's a choice. You can let that die and be like one of these rock guys that get Grumpy. old, yeah. get old, that don't like nothing new and just lives from the past. Oh, the old glory days. It's like, fuck the glory days. This is the glory days right now. This is, a, this is as good as, as it was 20 years ago or 30 years ago, you know, it's, it's a choice that you can make. And we made the choice to, 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 to like a lot of this new stuff and get in touch with them and, and get involved with them, which I think is great, you know, and I, I love that. And um, I wouldn't change for anything. I, I saw a Nails video I thought was really cool, the making of their new album. And the drummer, he says that, that the whole inspiration for him is uh, Igor's drumming on a rise. And that's so cool to hear that. Yeah, you know, yeah. I was like, oh, yeah. No money can buy that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like, dude, this is so cool. It's like it's so killer to hear that. And then you go listen to the album, you know. Uh, you're not, you're not one of us. It's so sick. Yeah. It's such a great record, you know. So it's, it's very inspiring to hear stuff like that, you yeah. know, for us. Oh, the cool thing is the respect level that is really cool because I, yeah. a lot of those guys really loved and respect uh, what what we did in Sepultura. Yeah. So a lot of them get uh, super uh, honored to have us liking them. You know, you know, and it's kind of a like Igor says, kind of a cycle. Like uh, we get influenced by them, yeah, and we also influence them. You know, uh, there's a letter that I got. I got a package from uh, from Todd from Nails. You know, and he said in the letter, he says, "Yeah." By the way, on, on Silent Death, I I sneak in the territory riff, and I hope you don't mind, you know. It's like, yeah, brother, you know, the more the better. That's that's killer, you know. I love to hear that, you know. And so I think that's uh, that that is that's really cool that happened. The whole uh, respect factor, you know. And we always had that uh, with Sepultura, and uh, it continues now with whatever we are doing, you know. So uh, looking forward to more new things, discovering yeah. more new bands in the future.